Hi guys, welcome to another episode of the Draft of Glory, the final one of the week. Path to Glory is active as I'm making this video. I think it will be active as you guys are watching as well. Um, but today we have obviously started listing up consumables and that stuff like that. We're going to hopefully try and make some money and uh, get rid of a lot of the consumables we had in the back of the club and hopefully uh, get a nice mini fortune at the end of the video. So if you guys do want any MSP, PSN codes or cheat game codes, go and check out G2A.com, their link is down below. If you're trying to hit over 3,000 likes, that'd be brilliant. And guys, subscribe to me and hit the bell button so you never miss an upload on the channel. Um, so with the Draft of Glory this week, it's been literally two wins, two second round exits slash DCs, and then hopefully trying to get a better win uh, ratio this week. Now you can see we've got 51 draft entries, 38 w wins in a row, which is still a pretty good average, um, but could be a lot better in my opinion. So we're going to try and uh, obviously pick up a win today. We're going to end up with the 15,000 coins and uh, get drafted and we're building to win. Now we did do the four, is that four and two and two narrow? I'm going to go with the 41212 narrow today, guys. Uh, we did the 4312 yesterday and we did work with it, and I'm hoping that can be the same today. Now if we take Messi. Uh, Messi will be a bench player, so I'm going to take Lionel Messi as a bench player and then start off in the starting eleven to see what, in fact, we can get. My God. My God. Right. Lukaku again. Let's go with him. I'm hoping to get some Path to Glory players. We've not really had any uh, selection uh, of them. I much prefer Ericsson. This could be a spitting image of yesterday's draft. Apart from obviously Ericsson was uh, a non inform. Got Matuidi, Sol, Moutinho. Uh, let's go with the French Matuidi. We might be able to, might be lucky enough to get Pogba. Tony Wong. Oh, Kante, team of the year Kante. That's a very, very nice pull. And then another French CDM would be nice. Bakayoko would be good. Hasn't popped up, but um, we haven't really got any Juventus players either. We have got obviously a Serie A link. Uh, let's go with Party. Yeah, let's go with Party. Party is a very good player if you get if you are able to use him in the game. No Juventus, but there is a BPL player there, so we'll take Coleman. I might end up swapping them two over just temporarily, and then seeing what we get in the defence. So looking to obviously get Chelsea. See, we have got Chelsea players. No Juventus. And no French, so we'll go with uh, with Cahill. Maybe swap them two round. Doesn't really make a difference, does it? Um, might do, dependent. That's even better, actually. We get a French, another French player uh, in Koscielny. And then right back, Alba, Leighton Baines. No French is there. Alba... Kolarov. So we'll go with Leighton Baines. I'll swap them two over as well. And then the goalkeeper, De Gea. I'll take it. He has got higher rated versions, but I will go with him. Um, that was a free pick as well. I think it's just dropped down too. So we're getting Zagi. I'll take him to partner Lukaku. Gives links to everyone as well. Um, goalkeeper again. Ruffier and Testegan. I think just for the rating. Yeah, just for the rating, I'll take Testegan. Not a bad card in defence. I'm looking for a better right wing. Ooh. Ooh, in fact. Alex Sandro. I could get him in. Boom, there we are. We can get him in. Path to glory. Yeah, we can use him and the team's looking all right. Apart from the camera position, the team's looking all right. Ward, Crisquito. Uh, we'll go Crisquito. Midfield picks. If I can get a better cam. Ooh, Gundogan. German. Uh, do we go Gundo or do we go Silver? I think Gundo we're alright with. I'm going to go with uh, that 92 rated Silver. Offers me a Spanish link as well. Does actually take us to 100 chem. And, dependent, we might be able to... I think we're on full chem anyway. Just looking for better players. Another path to glory there. I'm going to take him as old Giliano. And then we've got five more picks left. Neymar, Cavani. Neymar or Cavani. I'll take Nene. We got Messi already. Um, another path to glory. Stindle. Tellez, Insigne, and Ruiz. I'll take Stindle. Three more picks. No one there to come on in. Uh, so we'll go Rayton or Alana. Looking for a better BPL cam if possible. 
We get a better right back. Ah, we get De Bruyne though. Can I get, can I use, there's no point with that one. So he's a right off. It's between Kyle Walker, but we've got Coleman, so I'm happy with that. And we get De Bruyne. And I'm going to take uh, BPL centre back to so you're right there. I'm going to take De Bruyne, guys. He's going to play Cam just because of the links. And it takes everyone to full chemistry as well. So let's see if we can get another Kyle Walker pick here. A lot of nice picks. Unfortunately, none of them are going to work. That Ishmael looks good. Um, but I think I might go with rating to bring the rating up. So I'll go with uh, Martinez. I don't think the defence are going to get a look in anyway. But we might be pushing guys close to a 190 again. Dependent. Oh, no, I don't think we are, actually. I might have made that up. Damn, we're not even close to a 189. Oh, yeah, we got a 189. There we go. So Path to Glory. Nice links. Yeah, we've done pretty good. We have done pretty good. Obviously, we've got not got a Ronaldo to carry us, but we do have Neymar, um, Neymar and Messi to come on and do do damage. Keeper, all right with as well, but that looks to be the draft for the day, guys. Um, everyone's on full. Could do with getting a French, a French manager, and then the job is done. And we do not hit a French. We do hit a Premier League though, uh, in Kettlethorpe. And that is the job finished. So, we've got Neymar, we've got Team of the Year, Kante, we've got a 189 mated draft. I'm hoping this one can take us for the final win in, in the draft of the week. Um, no, Ronaldo, no Ronaldo to carry us, but we have got, like I said, Neymar and Messi, um, which potentially could work. But I'm hoping I can just work with this team and, and get it smashed out that way. But only time will tell anyway. Um, thankfully, that 91 upgrade, De Bruyne came in and did give us chemistry. But overall, guys... We've done pretty good um, today. I'll probably end up swapping them two around, I think. Yeah. Hopefully that does the business anyway. So, guys, hopefully we get four games of the draft done. Fingers crossed we can pick up a win. and uh, Four wins in a row, anyway. And draft something good for the Path to Glory promotion, which is currently running. So, guys, we get to use another set of players. Similar to yesterday, because it is, obviously, the similar uh, hybrids which Bateson likes to build. But we did do all right getting to bring in uh, Path to Glory, Alex, Sandro, and also Inform Matawidi and Tinia Kante. So, all pieced together nicely. Now, this... Um, is obviously from directly after yesterday's draft where we picked up a direct win, which is obviously something which I love to do in the series. And then Suarez, in, well, 41st minute, guys, puts in a nice volley. Ball headed over to him. He smashed it in and goes 1-0 up. He brought Suarez on as a sub as well. We were able, not long afterwards, to get the ball rolling. You can see how defensive, defensive he was. But Inzaghi getting dropped inside the area, guys. Uh, Laporte hanging on the back of him. He goes to get a shot off, but he's made the tackle and uh, stopped his uh, shooting leg from getting uh, unleashed and uh, hopefully putting it into the back of the net. But he does get another opportunity to do so, and uh, it is from the resulting penalty. We do the two taps to the left, go to the right, and uh, make it 1-1 in the 44th minute, just before half time. So a very, very nice goal uh, by Inzaghi. I've enjoyed using... He's not really an icon which a lot of people would want to go near. Obviously, in drafts, I always go near any icon because he offered chemistry to every single player. Um, and Inzaghi is a clinical goal scorer. He was back in the day as well when he actually played um, football. But he's not uh, like one of them go-to icons which a lot of people would want to use. Another clinical striker next to him, Inzaghi and... Uh, um, Inzaghi and Lukaku putting the ball away together, whether one be from the penalty spot and one be from outside play. Uh, but I have absolutely zero complaints with Lukaku. He's been doing the business for me, not only in yesterday's draft, but also in today's one, just getting me that second goal. Inzaghi with the ball puts it outside to Silva. Silva through to Lukaku. Um, nice drag back, waiting for the uh, runners. Gets it on the inside to Inzaghi. And Inzaghi, yet again, gets tripped inside the area. This time, Moses. Uh, puts a tackle in and drops him in the 57th minute. The game was looking clean for me and uh, looking like we were going to obviously take a two-goal lead um, in this game. We put it to the left-hand side this time because we went right with the first penalty and uh, we go 3-1 up. Now, the rest of the game was spent with me pushing on, knocking on the door and he couldn't find a way back into the game, which is spot on for me because I love games like this. And in the 83rd minute, we get through for Inzaghi. I was messing around trying to do a drag back um, around the goalkeeper. He boots the ball out of play and uh, does leave the game and uh, a nice disconnection I love these rage quits so he just quits out the game 
And that's his draft run over and done with. And that was continues into the quarter final. Up against uh, Coutinho, inform striker Bale, Dybala, who's not on full chem, but the rest of the players, I think, apart from Bale, isn't on full chemistry. He's got Laporte, um, the La Liga version, Path to Glory, Varane, Perejo, Vieira, and also Iniesta in the midfield. But a very slow team. And in the fifth minute, guys, De Bruyne linking through with Silva, through to Lukaku. Nice turn of his body and a brilliant left footed shot into the far corner makes it 1-0 in the 6th minute and uh, does get us back continuing how we're playing um, in the previous game. Now obviously we're going to push for more goals um, but it was actually my opponent Dybala through to Ozil and uh, as you can see guys I wasn't actually controlling my players uh, my battery went dead on my controller so I had to plug it in and by the time he got back I had got back sorry Bale had made it 1-1 and uh, equalised the game up in the 8th minute. I think it was directly after I scored as well. But the 10th minute with ball through to Matuidi. He makes a misplaced pass, but Lukaku tackles the ball. He gets it over to Matuidi through to Inzaghi. Inzaghi with a low driven shot past the keeper. 2-1, back into the lead. And uh, a nice celebration to... Uh don't know, give us our worth in the game. So the next goal would be important. Obviously, I don't like my, my uh, opponent scoring, as do anyone in FIFA. Um, so I'm just looking to try and get the game over and done with. Lukaku with the control, the pass. And uh, nice one too. Gets the ball through to De Bruyne. De Bruyne gets tackled, but the ball bounces out. Lukaku picks it up on the outside of the area. Um, gets it on the inside, fails. Another tackle, ball through to Inzaghi. Nice positioning, brilliant shot. In off the post, and that is a low driven shot. The start button was pressed by, by, by our opponent. And you guys know what's happening. Um, he didn't want to continue the rest of the game because we got three goals in a matter of 16 minutes. Um, but it was a fun run regardless. So we do get the rage quit in the quarterfinals. And that leaves us with our next opposition, which is going to be the semi-final. So the semi-final opponent coming up on the screen now is Benteke, Chadley, um, Herrera, then he's got the left the left hand side is nuts. The team of the year, Marcelo, the prime Maradona, and the team of the year, Ronaldo. He's also got um, De Bruyne, even though his player face has gone missing for this game. Christian, so, uh, Christiansen in form Valencia. And a few others as well. Silver with a ball out to Kante. Kante cuts on the inside, gets it through to De Bruyne. De Bruyne works the space, gets a shot off into the far corner, and we go 1 0 up within four minutes. They're the type of goals I love scoring in FIFA. I don't know why. They're just my favourite type of goals where you completely bamboozle the defender. He runs the other way, leaves you with a space to smash it into the top. They were a lot more prominent last FIFA when I did them then. But a long through ball, Maradona gets a running defender. I don't know, I was stupid. He squares it over, simple finish. I don't know why he brought the keeper out, but 1 1 easy as that like I said that left hand side of the team that he does have is very very strong then it gets even worse guys ball through to uh, Mertens Mertens through to De Bruyne De Bruyne working the space gets a shot off by uh, uh, to De Gea I go for the long ball out and this is how fast we can turn defence to attack guys Lukaku driving the ball forward waiting for the players to come and support gets it over to Inzaghi nice fake shot nice pass over the defender and De Bruyne with a smash and grab um, straight away makes it 2-1 and uh, does put us back into the lead in the 37th minute. But you can see um, in the spaces of uh, me scoring the goals and him getting the goals, it was a tight game. 41st minute, not long afterwards, Lukaku working the space, sees De Bruyne in the middle, he works the position, gets a low driven shot off, in off the post, and that is 3-1 in the 42nd minute. Trying to get my opponent to leave the game. Wasn't to be, the dab didn't work, even though I do it now and then. Inzaghi through to Silva, Silva with the ball outside to Coleman, um, who have still. I don't know, not a fan of Coleman, not a fan of Coleman. I'm doing for chemistry purposes, but not a fan. Inzaghi with the ball, working the space, goes for the finesse shot from outside the area. 4 1 up in the 49th minute, and uh, my opponent still was in the game, uh, looking to get that bit of punishment which uh, I was uh, handing out with uh, Lukaku and Inzaghi. Lukaku with the ball outside to Matuidi, Matuidi back to Lukaku, Lukaku over to Inzaghi. Inzaghi works the position with a drag back, low driven shot, as simple as that. 5 1. In the 59th minute, four goals clear. I didn't feel like my opponent had any chance to get back into the game. And it was all those uh, from that position out. But you can see um, in the 61st minute, uh, I had a free kick. He had like 30 in game minutes. We go for a pass out and then the game just disconnects, guys. So another rage quit. And uh, that's us through to the final of the foot draft for the second time in a row. We've won it yesterday. Hopefully I can win it again today. Uh, and this is the uh, opposition team. William Path to Glory, which is a new one. The um, team of the knockout stage or team in the group stage. I don't know what, what cards it were. Uh, Griezmann, Batshuayi, Team of the Akante, Inform Silver and a few other nice players in his team. Ball through to De Bruyne. He gets it to 
through Lukaku. Lukaku to Inzaghi. He takes one touch and then bangs it into the bottom corner. That is 1-0 in the third minute. But my opponent had clinical players. He had dangerous players um, in the team. And we just had to kind of catch him out. You can see Lukaku gets tackled there. I was waiting for the overlapping run of De Bruyne. In through to William. William to Batshuayi. He gets a break on the defence. Some bad defending by me allows a ball. And he smashes it straight at the keeper. Keeper jumps over it. And that is 1-1 in the 20th minute of the game. An annoying goal to concede, guys. Uh, but... What can you do, you know? Second half comes around. Ball through to Coleman. Coleman sees a long through ball down to Lionel Messi. Messi with the overlapping ball to Neymar. Neymar by himself does a little bit of trickery. Uh, defender commits to him. It's actually Van Dijk this time commits to him and does take his legs out, giving the uh, referee no, this, no other decision but to give it a penalty and uh, give us a chance to put it into the back of the net again. Already in the past two days, I've done two drafts and got a lot of penalties. Inzaghi this time does, does the two steps to the left, puts it to the right-hand side and the keeper jumps to the left. 2-1 in the 52nd minute. This was a good position to be in in the final, and it gets even better, guys. In the 90th minute, he's got a red card. Inzaghi dancing with the ball. He goes to clear it, uh, but we're in the position to pick up the loose ball. Um, you can see a nice uh, pass and play there. Coleman through to De Bruyne. De Bruyne through to Kante. Uh, sorry, Matuidi. Matuidi through to Neymar, and he's got a position to do a shot because the keeper's off his line. And that is the final goal. 3-1 in the draft final. We pick up another win, but can we finally pack a path to glory player? And there we are, guys. Two in a row. I couldn't be more happy about getting that. A Samba Prince. Um, give me a good fight, but we did uh, obviously get the three goals, which were important to the victory. And uh, now we're up to 555k, which I think was what we're on when we just started the episode anyway. 3-1, um, 3-1, 5-1 and 3-1. Not a bad uh, bunch of results anyway. So in the final pack, we get a rare player pack and a 50k, um, sorry, a 50k pack and a gold pack. We've had that earlier on. I'm going to go and see what's sold in the trade pile. I actually should have done that before doing this, actually. Because if that's a duplicate player, we are screwed. In terms of having to keep any duplicate players, we're going to have to get rid. Thankfully, it's not looking like we... No, we haven't. We've got to look here. Um, so, redeem the 1k coins. I'll keep... I'm not going to take the silver contracts either, because they don't sell for anything. I was looking at the uh, market. So, we can keep all that. And discard the rest, getting 182 coins back. And it's the same with the gold contracts as well. Um, so before we do go on, guys, we'll move over to transfers, see what has sold. And you can see 350, 300, 400, 150 uh, for that one. Squad fitness is 250, 650, 750. So they're going for about the price that they were anyway. In fact, that one even went for more. So we can clear the trade pile, um, see what else at the back of it which hasn't sold. And we'll just whack that all out for 200. So... 200, 200, and hopefully we can make some money off uh, consumables because we've been stacking a lot of them into the club, but we've never, in fact, done anything with them anyway. Um, and now is the time with the promotional packs that EA are putting out where it's just like 100Ks, 125Ks. I may as well just get rid of everything and um, take the coins now because this is when people might want it. So we've got Gladiator Chem Style and Marksman Chem Style. don't think they sell for anything. If they don't sell this time, we'll get rid uh, he was minimum anyway, so I can discard him. 240, 240, and three, 246. Uh, list that one for 200. And I think that's everything. There we go. So some actually, some things have sold literally straight away. Oh, no, we're not just not clear the trip, pal, have we? Oh, and one of the players, one of the healings has sold as well. So... Here we are, guys, onto the 50k pack. Now, we've opened the gold pack. We're onto the 50k pack, hoping for a Path to Glory player. Last time we did this, we got a, a Finn pack. We've not got a Finn pack. We've got an 83+, plus, which are selling for a little bit at the moment. A Spanish centre mid. Oh, it is an 83, guys. We missed out on Path to Glory. But there's still going to be three more drafts next week, guys, where Path to Glories are still going to be in packs. Um, so we've hit David Villa, Cazorla. He's selling for an inflated amount in here, so I may as well get rid of him now. Um, we'll hold on to the remaining players and get rid of the rest into the into the trade pile. So, we've uh, done alright this week, guys. Uh, three wins, two losses, but... We're back to winning ways towards the end of the week. Anyway, we'll be back on Monday, guys, the next episode of Draft of Glory. And uh, hopefully I'm able to use more Draft of Glory, uh, Path to Glory players, which do come out by um, EA or are out now, in fact, which we've not been able to use. Until next time, guys, see you later. Have a very, very nice rest of your day.